an indoor school. So it's exciting when we gather together. As I was telling our first grade friends, this is our all school assembly. It's only the entire school, all 25 classrooms, staff, students, we all gather to come together and talk about things, celebrate things, whatever it may be. Today we're here to talk about PBIS, which is really positive behavior in school. It's everything that we talk about every day. And it all starts with this. Give me five, right? What does that mean? It's a, someone, let's talk about two eyes, focus on what we're speaking, two ears listening, and our lips are closed. And you guys are doing a great job of that now. And that's really the beginning and the premise of doing the right thing. It surrounds four key words. Every morning you hear me say them on the announcements. We have conversations about them. And those four key words are being respectful, responsible, kind, and safe. Great job, everyone. And the kindness is really important. That's a new word that we had this year. And it's those four words that make up the bear tracks of success. And so today's assembly is really talking about what does that look like? And we'll focus on kindness. Because I've, I've seen a lot of kindness today since the start of school. And it's something we'll continue to focus on. We can never have enough kindness. Alright? And it's those four words. If we're following the bear tracks of success, then it's going to be a great day. And I've seen everyone doing it. I've seen students holding doors open for other students. I've seen students walking quietly in the hallways, whether it's individually by yourself from the bathroom, whether it's at the class. I've seen you being kind, saying please and thank you. These are all great things. And as a school, we want to recognize this great behavior. Your, your teachers do, I do, Mrs. Connors. And so Mrs. Connors is going to talk a little bit about how do we recognize students in classes when they're following the bear tracks of success.
all around the school. He gets to go when a class is caught following the bear track's success and you've earned many ground. Your class has earned many ground for the entire week. He comes to your classroom, usually with a journal, with all of his ventures, sometimes with different clothes, whatever it may be. He arrives in your classroom and he gets to be with you all week. He goes with you to specials, he stays in his classroom for lunch, and he says otherwise he gets to hang out with your class for the entire week. Mini Brown. 24. He will make his first visit and he will be stopping by his first classroom. So I uh, look forward to seeing where he arrives and over the announcements you'll be able to track his travels throughout the school. So let's see what Brownie brought me. Some certificates here. I'd like these students to come up because they were caught being kind. And one thing I will show you is tomorrow morning at 8.30 to 8.45, a lot of you see these spirit sticks. Last time we looked here, last time I haven't seen you before, these are spirit sticks. They will be on sale, the more school ones, tomorrow, May 30th, May 45th, thanks for our PTA. Those that have had birthdays already, you receive a happy birthday spirit stick from our more school PTA. That's the gift to you on your birthday. And so the very first time they were selling spirit sticks, before we got any certificates, there were two students that were caught being kind. As there was a long line, everyone was getting their spirit sticks, these two students, a lot of first graders bought their spirit sticks. They come on these little key rings and they didn't know how to get them on their backpack. And two students stepped up right away and said, I'll help, and they just started putting on those spirit sticks on backpacks. Not just one, not just five, it was like ten. They just kept on going. So I'd like Teddy Harrington and Jacob Dalton to come on up.